Hey, this is Al McGee with your entertainment ticket at www.yeticket.com. Well, the film I'm going to talk about right now is called Measure of a Man. Well, let me tell you a little bit about this story, but when I first saw this story as it started, you know, credits is over, and I see this family, it's in the summer of 1976, packing up to go away for the summer, you know, to their water property, wherever, wherever is that. But I said, have I seen this film before? I've seen films like this before. They started like this before. Well, I had to continue to look and make sure that I have not seen this film before, but I have seen something like this before, and that's the problem I had with this film. I've seen something like this before. But anyway, this is in the summer of 1976, and teenager Bobby Marks, which is played by Blake Cooper, well, you know, he's a little fat, he's a little overweight, he's heavy, and, you know, he... Uh, a little bit self-conscious about that. In fact, when he gets to where they're going, you know, people are there in the lake, they're swimming, they're having a great time. But he doesn't do that because he's afraid to do it because he's afraid to take off his shirt and his shorts to show people his body. You know, young men go through that. You know, if they're not, if they're not looking a particular way, well, they might do that when they're young, you know, when they're 17, 16, 17, 18 years old. But as I said before, this is a typical coming to age of story, and it is based on a fiction novel called One Fat Summer by Robert Lips. And it's about young Bobby, how, you know, he learned how to find himself. Now, I want to know, I wish I can ask the producers, why did they make this film? First of all, it's directed by Jim Loesch. Now, he's a television director. And it looked like television. It, it really did. It felt like TV. It felt like a Lifetime movie. It, you know, it just really felt like that. And, you know, Donald Sutherland, he's in his film, too. Well, anyway, Bobby, he takes a job working for Dr. Khan, which is played by Donald Sutherland. And, you know, Bobby learns how to work hard. He never did that before. In fact, even in his film, you know, his father left and his father said, hey, you know, won't you barbecue the meat and things like that. He didn't know how to do that. Well, again, like I said, this is 1976 and it really brought back some memories for me. For example, the phone ringing in the house where there's only one phone. They only had one television in the house. Uh, you know, the house that they, they rented for that month that they stayed up there in the lake. But anyway, Bobby, you know, he, he was getting bullied by the town people in there, uh, you know, f for some reasons that didn't make any sense. And the bullies, you know, they're a little older guys anyway who lived there in the town. And they, they were a little jealous of the people who came up there because when they left, they were still there stuck. Well, there was nothing unusual about this story or this film. Like I said, it just felt like a TV movie. And, of course, you know, Bobby learns a lot about himself. Measure of a Man, like I said, there was nothing unusual about this film. You've seen this before. I'm only going to give this one and a half palm trees out of four for this film. You've seen it. I've seen it. And you experience it. But see this film for yourself. And you let me know what you think about it. I'm Al McGee with your entertainment ticket. Thanks for watching my review. I really appreciate this it. This is your entertainment ticket. Latest and greatest.